going to have a lot of exciting news for the coming year. This generic room have to turn into my home for the next 30 days. Personalized badge. You're down. Laps 20. Rolly. Minimums. 40. Flare green. 30. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Christmas Eve today. Wake up this morning. Look at this beautiful snowy day. Snowed at night, so it's going to be a beautiful uh, white Christmas. I want to wish you all a very, very Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays to all of you. Let me clear up the car a little bit. I'll take out the bike, and I'll tell you something really interesting. Actually, I'll roll the car out, then I'll clear it up over there where I, all the snow goes uh, down on the ground so I can take the bike out. It's beautiful. You see my hand over here sticking out? What's, what's beautiful with these uh, modern cars, they have the backup camera, so even the car is completely covered with snow. Usually you can back up, reverse the car up. Anyway, guys, I wanted to do this video and just wish you really, really uh, happy holidays. I had a, a great year uh, and I have a lot of exciting news for the coming year. I'll have another video coming out for uh, just before the end of the year, but stay tuned for a second. Give me a second. Take the sporty out. We clear up all the snow from the car. It's not that much, but... Here, in terms of the channel growing and uh, more and more subscribers, more and more content, I really appreciate it. You know, um, whenever I come to the computer and see your comments, I see your, uh, I see your remarks. I see people. I look at the stats. I see people uh, watching, interacting, enjoying. I get nice emails from you guys every once in a while, a letter or something. I really appreciate it. It warms my heart. It really feels good. Uh, you know, in these days where everything around us is like a little bit, I don't want to say doom and gloom, but not too, uh, not too exciting, let's put it that way. Uh, I do see bright light whenever I uh, go into the, to the channel. So I really appreciate your support and your, you know, enthusiasm. This, the, it, it excites me. It's really fun. With, uh, with all this uh, cold weather, it's not, not as exciting to go ahead out and ride, and sometimes it's actually really impossible. So you know, try to come up with ideas of what to, what to tell you, uh, to keep you engaged, to keep you entertained. So I, go, I went through some footage that I had uh, from a, actually three years ago, believe it or not, three years ago. And I realized you guys actually enjoy a lot of the aviation stuff. So this is what I'm going to show you now is a video that I uh, did three years ago believe it or not look at it three years ago you can see my raw uh, acting over there or how you know uh let's put how a rookie a rookie video but i think you'll enjoy it very much it's i did a, a course that i was uh i did a course three years ago i did a course i stopped flying on the jumbo 747 400 the boeing 7 the jumbo jet and I uh, learned how to fly uh, the Dreamliner, the Boeing 787. So I went for three, for like a, almost a month and a half course in England, middle of nowhere in England, uh, in a facility. I was away from the family for like a month, a month and a half uh, to finally get my, uh, my license. Anyway, so at the time when I put the video out, I got, I don't know, three, four or 500 people watching it. It was a good video in my opinion. I'm sure now when I have way more uh, viewers, subscribers, you guys will enjoy it. So take a look. That's I called it how to get a license, how to how to learn how to fly a 787. Hi, I am Sandy and in this video I will tell you what it takes to get a license to fly a Boeing 787, also known as the Dreamliner. Black, keep the Toyota View about the Chotek. Switching over to the 787. This is T 
Winfield Gate Park. Look how pretty it is. Reminds me of home. 30 days ago, I left home and came here to Crawley, United Kingdom, a small town in the middle of uh, the UK with a Boeing training center in just in the center of it and started my uh, training for the 787. עשינו שעתיים וחצי, משהו כזה. That's it. So I've got to turn this generic room. This generic room have to turn into my home for the next 30 days. So let's uh, start. Okay, electronic station is set. Next is this. Day two. Just checked in. Our first day starting now. Lovely lady over here helped us out. Personalized badge. There you go. Just got a, a goodie bag. Every course, the first part of the course is uh, the theoretical uh, studies, airplane uh, systems, procedures. Uh, in the good old days, you used to study in a classroom with an instructor. Nowadays, they do everything on computers called CBT, computer-based training. So we sit in these uh, cubicles that are... Uh, that look like a computer, like look like the, the cockpit uh, with all the panels. Uh, goes through all the systems. It has little exams uh, along the way, and uh, you learn uh, all day long, pretty much. After lunch, you just fall asleep. I wake up after. All of a sudden, the the thing repeats itself. I realize that I've been sleeping for the last 20 minutes. Once we were done with that, we started uh, training on the full flight simulator, which is the actual real flying, handling, doing uh, many procedures, uh, different flight uh, patterns, you know, practicing uh, uh, engine failures in the air, fires, fires in the engine, system malfunctions, and... Meanwhile... One of the things we love to do is come out here and have a good cup of coffee. So you like this shirt? It's uh, halfway through the course, uh, two, three days off because of the Jewish holiday, just chilling at uh, Pret, Pret Manger. <laughs> three days later. Some time off from uh, studying dinner. Beautiful uh, area, Crawley. They've got a downtown. It's not really downtown, but it's old and historic. Buildings here are beautiful. Look at this. It's a pub. It's like a bar in this place. finally get a check ride where it's a skill test and a different examiner comes in and wants to see that you know how to fly the airplane you know how to run the pro the and you know how to run the procedures properly down. here down laps 20 minimums 40 flare green 30 20 10. Idle. And that's it. That's our machine. Bye bye. And once you're done with that, you pretty much get your uh, FAA license to fly the 787. But it doesn't end there. Say the next what? stage is the transition flight, where you take an airplane and with an instructor, no passengers, and you pretty much take off and land, take off and land, and learn to feel the airplane. That's what you used to do in the good old days. Nowadays with simulation being so accurate, so precise, you can actually take a simulator uh, with an instructor and just do those flights. So This place is 
so relaxing and so beautiful. That's Buki. So it's a beautiful day and today off. Uh, yesterday was our first, uh, yesterday was our check ride. It was great. Finally over and we got this beautiful weather today. Just, just walked to the park and uh, videotaping this video. Uh, tonight is my uh, transition flight, like I told you before. It's not uh, on the actual airplane, but uh, gonna fly like four hours in Hong Kong. So this is Hong Kong. This is, this is, I've never been to Hong Kong. It's my first time here in Hong Kong. Look at the beautiful scenery. And later on, I'll be flying. There we go, into the cloud. That's it. We're done. Five weeks. Uh, yeah, it was great. Thank you very, very much. Thank you so much for everything. That's it. And that's it on our way home. <laughs> Thank you. We're gonna miss these corridors. This is my room. This is my room for the last month. Yeah, what a mess. Got a pack. Everything has to go back in there. Look how much laundry I have. So from here on my, on my way home, next step is going to be uh, an observer fly where I just uh, come in as an observer, see how the procedures run, and see a flight without uh, taking part in the flight. And the next flight after that, pretty much, I re wear my uniform and start operating the airplanes. Hey, if you're new to this channel, you've never seen my videos, you want to see more of them, please subscribe to the channel. Click that uh, big logo, I am Sandy logo and click that bell button so you get notifications for next videos if you enjoyed this video give me a like share it with other people until the next video on the 787 when i'm actually flying the airplane peace out. so i hope you enjoyed that uh, short piece now you know how to get a license how to be a, a 787 uh, pilot in the works there is a collaboration with uh with another not sponsor but another supporter that I might be getting some uh, nice upgrades for the bikes. So it's going to be a lot of content, a lot of reviews of new items. So hopefully in the next uh, next few videos, you'll I'll reveal the uh, the big news. Now with the new uh, new variant, which in my opinion actually is uh, you know just my opinion, it's actually a good thing. Now hear me out. Don't get all excited. It's a good thing because. It is very contagious, but from what we're uh, learning, I think at this stage already, is, uh, is very mild. So pretty much this uh, variant is spreading fast and people that are getting sick are not, you know, thankfully not dying and not, nothing severe. And that creates some kind of a, a herd immunity. So I, I think it's actually a positive thing, but everybody's hysterical about it. So all the governments, all the, all the authorities are all you know, excited, all the news media, everybody's excited about it and hysterical about it. So also my airline is suffering because uh, Israel is actually closing its borders. So that means I won't be able to get back to Israel in the next, uh, next few weeks. So you guys will have to be patient with those t-shirts and poker chips that just vanished from the website. You guys love them, bought them all up. So next time I'm in uh, Israel, it's gonna be a few weeks I'll get as many as I can and bring them over so you guys can pick them up. Also on the website, I'm, I'm posting a lot of my used parts that I took off the bikes over the years. So if you're interested, go into uh, www.holyshift.us and check out uh, all the used items that I have over there. And that's it for now, guys. This is a short video. I just wanted this beautiful day, this opportunity with the snow all around to say, you know, Happy New Year, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays to everybody. And to get, again, to be very thankful for you guys, uh, the viewers, the watchers, the subscribers. Really, you support me. You support this channel, you know, with, uh, with your enthusiasm and the excitement. So thank you so much. I'm, I'm really uh, appreciative of this. Um, I'm Sandy, and you're watching Holy Shift. Till the next video, guys. 
Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, Happy New Year. Bye.